السلام عليكم بسم الله والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله uh, Good morning colleagues, ladies and gentlemen Welcome to this second very special edition of the Security Middle East Conference magazines which mark the 25th anniversary of the journal publication It's an honor for me to present this keynote speech on behalf of Saudi Aramco it's also a privilege to be in our nation capital city, the Riyadh, which is quickly becoming premier destination for international convention. We expect this beautiful city to host more such significant events in the years ahead. The aim of this conference is to present a perspective on the evolution and sustainability of security for smart cities and GIGA projects. It's also the goal to discuss human capital development and diversity in the security industry. These elements are part of the Kingdoms of Saudi Arabia Vision 2030. Furthermore, it's a crucial for security organization to cooperate internationally. Professional network often prove pivotal during crisis which, when exchanging information, can be the key. These gatherings encourage vital relationship between the region foremost security leaders and experts. In the end, we can only advance by sharing knowledge and best practices. This is why this forum are designed to present the latest know-how and showcase the most innovative technologies. They are annexes that help us to fuse a collective of a professionals who consider the security of people, assets, and operation to be a paramount importance. Such a group is required to mitigate harm and loss in these challenging times. Conference, our challenge is to secure the smart cities and giga projects worth hundreds of billions in isolated environment. In some region of the kingdom, we have discovered archaeological sites that are considered by the United Nations to be a priceless cultural treasure of our ancient civilizations. These spaces need to be protected. Yet, shared with others at the same time. Thus, we have to strike a balance between the requirement of security and safety of the people and guests and their freedom of movement. In addition, the fourth industrial revolution is upon us. The leading trend that will continue to shape the evolution and sustainability of the security industry during the next few years is technology. We must further embrace the role of artificial intelligence, machine learning, big data, and quantum computing are having on the enhancement of our capabilities. In recent times, digital transformation has been changing everything. Businesses have been automating their processes, operation, system, software, and data to augment their strategies and achieve their objective more efficiently and effectively. Security has been realizing the same throughout technological innovation. For example, scalable guard force management solutions, cloud-based license plate recognition system, biometric facial and fingerprint access control, internet protocol, CCTV surveillance, microwave and infrared intrusion detection, and integrated crisis and emergency responses platform have been developing rapidly. Evermore, advanced unmanned aerial vehicle technologies 
are emerging as a force multiplier for security. Behavioral and predictive artificial intelligence analysis is facilitating the metamorphosis of security officer from being a passive observers and responders to a being a proactive agent, deterring, detecting, and defending against harm and loss before they occur. And cybersecurity has become essential in the fight against increasingly complex digital threats and electronics attack by antagonists who wish to damage our critical infrastructure and environment. Just as our capability increase, however, our adversaries also continue to extend their and the new threats constantly emerge. It's a vital we continue to exponentially progress our proficiencies with the state of the art advancements. By way of example, a conglomerate strategically important, large and diverse as Saudi Aramco, could not thrive without seamless security system to mitigate risks. Aramco has been facing similar security challenges to those encountered by other transitional corporations around the world. Although Aramco has not suffered any kind of attack in the past couple of years, we remain ever vigilant. Accordingly, among much else, we have been upgrading our security threat intelligence solution to better inform our security risk assessment cycle and enable, uh, enable our leadership to make a welfare decisions. Security risk assessment is a vital to the evaluation of threats, vulnerabilities, consequences, and the likelihood of attack against our people, assets, and operation. Drones connected to our regional security centers and controlled by our mobile security officer patrol our remote pipelines and facilities observing for threats 24-7. Personnel and vehicle identification and access control mobile application have been developed for use in the field to empower our security officer as well as our customers. And the crisis management platforms support the integration and coordination of our emergency services halving their response times. Such innovation have significantly increased Aramco security, streamlined our processes, and compounded productivity throughout the organization. In order to manage the complexity of funding high-value cities and giga project in exceptional settings, we need people with talent who can be developed in the leaders and professionals, who care about people that can clarify ambiguities and which can guide others in uncertainty. In the energy sector, it has been proving difficult to attract talent due to largely false perception that this industry is a high-risk environment with overwhelming challenging conditions. By creating secure environments, we can draw people into the industry to achieve their full capacity. The cultivation of a specialist for the security industry is of paramount importance to our future. This means promoting security as a profession by establishing national security apprenticeship and certification programs, launching homegrown security degree and research courses, developing a security career pathway for school and university students, and encouraging public and private sectors organization to recruit, 
train and mentor early career security professionals. All over the world, more women are needed in the security profession. Like anybody else, women contribute different views, increase diversity thought, and consequently enhance creativity in the organization. Research has shown that the more diverse workforce, the more innovative it is. We must take immediate action to fill this gap. Saudi Aramco is a pioneer in this field, with women deployed as a security officer and emergency center operator throughout the kingdom. At Saudi Aramco, people are the heart of everything we do. Without our people, there would be no Aramco. The welfare of our people is our number one priority. The well-being of our people, students, consultants, contractors, and families, and those of our subsidiaries and business partners worldwide are of a paramount importance to our company. We promote an open reporting culture and empower our people to reach their full capacity and full potential by providing a safe and respectful work environment. So the Aramco also places extraordinary emphasis on the development of our staff with extremely high level of access to support for education and training. We especially care about the growth of our young professionals, as there is no doubt they are our future. One of our primary goal at Saudi Aramco is to train and educate all of our employees, not only those working in safety and industrial security, to be aware of the risk and how to mitigate those risks effectively. Aramco is also overcoming increasing, increasingly sophisticated technological challenges throughout the education of our management and employees. Most notably, we have developed our cybersecurity capabilities and increased awarenesses of such risk throughout our workforce. In 2022, Aramco conducted over 1,100 emergency exercises to train our employees and evaluate improvement opportunities. We extended our training program from being a conventional classroom-based learning experience to a hands-on competency-based learning approach. Virtual reality simulation have been introduced to create a collaborative training environment that enable multiple individuals to train together. This foster a culture of teamwork and security and safety awarenesses. To conclude, global security for international trade and commerce is crucial for the growth of our societies and economies. In the Middle East, as in any other region in the world, the security to sustain stability and progression. That is why in our company, security is seen as a critical success factor rather than simply business costs. It's appreciated by our leadership that without a robust security risk management model, Aramco would not be able will not be as resilient as it is now. Our security system has enabled the company to continue with business as usual, despite frequent security risks. Moreover, Aramco Security has continued to develop increasingly more sophisticated security solution through innovation technology, which has been resulting in more effective security process and decreasing security costs. 
I have no doubt that the security of our cities and projects will be valued in the same way that we will embed high technology in our process. And organization to enable us to maximize our outcomes. This will allow us to keep ahead of our adversaries and mitigate our risks. As I look around me at this conference, I also see that we have the talent to wield such power, the capability to develop our people, the will to do harness diversity and accelerate innovation, and the strength to overcome whatever challenges are put in our way. On behalf of Saudi Aramco, I thank you, and I hope you enjoy the conference. Thank you.